So this here will be useful if you're thinking about making your camera a DSLR camera or a camcorder usable via HDMI. There's different sizes of HDMI. This one I have here is a mini HDMI on this side. You can see that there. That mini HDMI is a male which refers to it going into the camera. So that is a 90 degrees because it's turned there and it's a left angle. That's important. I'll show you in a second what I mean. I've got my uh, camera and desktop set up there. So with these, what you want to do is a few things. You basically want to get that and have a normal HDMI because you could then get a normal HDMI cable like I have just over here and use it for the intended purpose. And you'll need a HDMI capture card. All of that I'm going to show you right now. That adapter I was talking about, what does that adapter do? I've got my DSLR camera here. Let me show you what it does. So on the side of the camera, we have a little port. That port allows you to insert your connector. Now, why would I say the left angle is important? Because it actually, if you notice that, the cable drops down. So when I put it on my tripod, it would be like this. If it's a right angle, what would have happened? It would have pointed upwards and you would have to do a little bend in that. So make sure you get the left angle if you're using it for this purpose. So I've plugged that in there, just like that. So now my camera is plugged in. So now the camera has the lead popping out. Get yourself a standard HDMI. Both HDMIs are male. That would go in to here, just like that. Then I've got a HDMI here. What do I do with that? That's where your HDMI capture card comes in. There's different types you can get. You can see, so I plug that there. Now that converter has made my HDMI into a USB. Now the USB. Goes into my computer. So that's how you connect a DSLR to a computer.